Good afternoon, gang. This is Ray Salvo, How I Failed at Affiliate Marketing. If you've been failing at affiliate marketing, my friends, you are not alone. It is around 2 p.m. Uh, September 2nd, 2016. Okay, uh, you guys know I got my tetsplans.com. This is my affiliate landing page. What I like to do is rebrand, okay? Uh, which Ted's plans allow you to do that. Alrighty, and this is basically just like a regular website. I got all these, uh, information, all these other, uh, links, my great link page, my Facebook, and so forth. Now, my members area is under reconstruction, okay? This is what they're gonna see if they try and log in. Um, basically, uh, you know, you don't wanna give everything out for free. Alright, I got this little section that's going to be in the members area for woodworking. This toolbar over here, um, most of these are pretty much all going to point to, um, you know, directly to the affiliate link. Okay, see my boat plans. Alright, and that's one way of doing it. Alright, that's usually how people do it, like if they have a blog and stuff. And, you know, they'll, they'll just put, um, you know, like they'll have their blog and then they'll, you know, they'll put, just put one link here. This is AdWords links because you know you get clicks if, uh, you get money if you click, if people just click on those. All right. So I want to make this like a little bookstore and this is why I love web starts so much. Okay. Uh, for example, here's a little pointer finger there icon and I'm going to use my keys, but you could just copy and paste this kind of stuff in here. It's phenomenal. This is what they call server-side software, okay? So now I want to put in my next book. So uh, I'm, a, I'm an affiliate um, to the Linkshare, okay? I don't know if you've ever seen them before, um, but I, I absolutely love these guys too. You know, they're pretty great, okay? Um, and what it is, is like I'm an affiliate with Walmart and they allow you to target, um, you know, they allow you to target uh, direct products. Okay, so I'm going to take this guy here, right? A splintered history of wood. Now, I, I want this picture. Of course, they allow you to use their images. If I just copy and paste this code in there, it's going to put this picture in there. It's going to be this size. I really can't manipulate it much. I mean, I am a coder. I don't want to go through that because my dyslexia, I could screw things up bad. I've done it many times in the, in the past. So you right-click on any image on the Internet, and uh, you copy the image address, right? All right, then you just go back to the web starts, and we're already signed in. And again, this is web starts, server-side software. That means the software is on their computers, and they've been in the game for a long time, okay? So I'm going to insert image. And if you sign up with me, I can teach you how to do all this stuff, all right? And um, I think that was the little one I just put in there. Yeah, let me get rid of him because there's too many. Okay, so if you sign up with me, like in, in these programs and these companies that I use uh, I've been through hundreds of them and you know the ones that I with I'm with now the only ones that I know that work for me anyway okay so we want to get the JPEG this doesn't always happen okay because that was in an iframe that's why that picture is being put there so sometimes you got to get rid of the code okay and um, depending on how fast your internet connection is and how large the picture is all right, so that picture looked kind of big, so we're going to take a look at it here. This is phenomenal, phenomenal software. Now, I could put it in there and scale it down, you know, manually, just like you would any picture in a word processor or whatever, but the picture would still be big, and it would still have a lot to load up. Okay, so look at these editing tools. Again, web starts, server-side software phenomenal so I'm gonna crop this first just to save me some time okay we're gonna do that boom now the picture's still fairly large I don't want that big picture I want it more like a thumbnail so I happen to already know my size that I want okay and again if I were to just scale this down and I'll show you in a second now what this does is it dupes it okay that's a duplicate of it and I just go ahead and delete the original it's always gonna be there on the link share uh, affiliate site I can get it off of Walmart you know alright so you see it's pretty much the size I want it to be okay and again oh watch this this is a great feature I use this little button over here 
after I highlight that, and it moves everything down for me that's below it. It's phenomenal, phenomenal stuff. They actually just came out with that feature, okay? And again, I could have taken that big, huge picture and, you know, sized it to will, but, you know, the, 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 the megabytes of the picture is, is going to be too big, okay? All right, so same thing here. Um, I want to, all right, so say I want to tighten this up. I can not only move it with the mouse cursor by right clicking and holding it, I can move it with the keyboards left and right, up and down. It's just so phenomenal software. And once you master it, you can create web pages very, very quickly. All right, and I always like to save my stuff. So now what we're going to do, okay, um, what we're going to do is we're going to go back there and we're going to go right to the product on the Walmart site again, okay. And, you know, it's, it's small percentages. I, you know, I might get four or five bucks if somebody buys this book, but it's a cheap book, you know, and you can put the prices in there as well. Okay. So now what I'm going to do, yeah, this always takes a hundred years to load up. All right. So now what I'm going to do here. All right. Now I'm allowed to take all this information. So this is the information about the book. Which it kind of looks like it's cut off for some reason. Okay, I don't know why it's happening. All right, now I'm not the only guy that makes typos. Look, whoever put that in there made a typo, so we'll just we'll just edit it a little bit. Okay, so now I'm going to add some text, and you know what you could do is there's so many different ways of doing this. It took me years to learn. I've been with these guys since you know like 2007, I think it was. You know, like a long time. Okay, so I pretty much mastered it. And what happens is when you sign up with me, I'm not going to let you hang either. If you're having problems, uh, you know, I can just create the stuff for you and, you know, help you out that way too. All right, our daily lives would be so different there would. Okay, so for some reason, let's go back to that and see what's going on with it. I'm going to do a refresh, maybe because I stopped it. All right, but I ain't going to wait for that. I'm going to go right here and see in a world without wood. Let's see how it looks. Okay, in a world without wood, we might not be here at all. We wouldn't have the fire, heat, shelter. Oh, that's interesting. That allows us to expand into the planet's color regions. If civilization should somehow... If civilization somehow did develop, our daily lives would be vastly different. Oh, that kind of sucks. Okay. So again, uh, you, you always run into all kinds of problems. Uh, show more. Maybe that's my guy there. All right. So, oh, wait a minute. Customer review. Okay, so we'll just keep that short and sweet. I don't really know anything about this book. All right, and boom, I can edit it here. Okay, would be vastly different. Let's just keep it at that. All right, and keep them wanting more. Okay, so that's that for that. And uh, what I'm going to do, see, like, I could t chop, chop it apart and put the link on the picture as well. But, again... You know, I don't want to screw up the code even though I'm experienced. And basically, it's because I'm experienced at that, that I'm not going to do that. <laughs> okay. And if you could see the difference in the font, number one, it, 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 it offers contrast. All right. And I'm going to use my keyboard here to move this guy over to try and line it up. Okay. A little better. All right. Um, you know, not only offers contrast, but this particular book had a lot of, in that area where I just showed you, where I got it from the Walmart site, had a lot more text on it, obviously, um, you know. And the more wording you want, the better on each page. You want at least 2,000 words per page. That's so vital for the search engines. You know, people don't realize that. And again, we could buy paid traffic, but over the course of a couple of years, you'll be getting free traffic because, um, it'll, you'll just get high ranking on the search page. You'll get what they call status. Okay. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is we're going to go back to the, um, the link share, um, window there. Okay. And check this out. 
you can either have uh, image links, which is this one, or text link. And if you watch up here, when I click on that text link, okay, that that's going to change. Okay, and then I'm going to, if you, I'm back down here again, I'm going to open it in a new window, because that's what you always want to do. And I'm going to copy this code, okay. Then I'm going to go back to Web Starts. I'm going to go to Insert, HTML Code. Boom, 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 and boom. And there it is. Okay. All righty. And what happens is when you do this type of coding, it's more like using a combination between paint and a word processor, you know. Um, the reason why, I'll move this down a little bit try and even things out uh, and, the, and like the reason why I put the little finger there is to let people know because it's going to look different on everybody's computer don't be discouraged if you create a website okay and it looks it looks when things might be off-centered or something like that you know uh, on someone else's computer or tablet or anything and again if you remember this 960 is where you want to be okay 960 is, is definitely where you want to be and it'll look pretty good on any device okay now what I what I did here was I put that little arrow there because like on my computer the way I got it I mean I know I'm, I'm I got a link there all right and and you want to use traditional type of links which I should be using here to make it look like it's underlined you know I'm gonna go back later and fix that up and then I'm just gonna test this and again it opened in a new window Okay, uh, there's my number right there, the 22307, okay, and uh, hopefully somebody buy a bunch of these books from me, all right, so we click off that, and what we're going to do, we're back here, and that quickly, you know, you can add, edit, edit your links now, now remember, uh, I don't know if you remember my last video. Okay, um, let me see. Uh, what they do? I think it's that one. Okay, you remember how they said, you know, you don't need any prior experience or skills. You don't know how to do, you don't need to know how to do web mastering or anything like that. Yeah, you do. You kind of do. Okay, I don't know if it's because of my dyslexia or what, but I, I can't stand WordPress. I just can't stand it. And honestly, I can't get it. I do all kinds of coding. I write my own programs and everything. And I can't get the crap. Okay? So, uh, basically, again, there's several different types of ways that you can do the affiliate marketing. This is the way that you get involved. Okay? You're going to get involved with your members. All right, after I put as many books up here as I can possibly find, all right, this is going to be the next guy. All right, this is going to be the next guy. And this is, you know, the both companies that I'm using here, they make this so simple for us. Okay, can't get any, any more simple. Okay, it just, it's, you know, and, and I'm not saying that, you know, uh, you know, it's simple because I'm a genius, but it's great stuff. Okay. It's, it's great stuff, you know, and, uh, you know, I like to keep, and again, my, my videos are totally unscripted. Okay. I'm going to do one last picture for you because I like to keep them, uh, 15 minutes long. I don't want to bore anybody. We're going to see if this goes through quick enough for me to do that. Okay, and then boom, I'm going to just put this in there real quick. Now you see the size of it. Okay, so I'm going to go back and edit that. Okay, so basically, uh, you know, don't get discouraged. Don't let things get to you. All right. Um, this is Ray Salvo. How I failed at affiliate marketing. Okay. Uh, you don't want to be this guy, of course. Uh, keep, keep at it. Keep the faith. Okay. Uh, I'm certainly here for you anytime you need me.
Okay, thanks. Have a good day.